Hey guys, I'm Deepthi Vesikin and today's video I'm going to be talking about some of my favorite liquid lipstick formulas. So when I did my lipstick that will betray you video, a lot of you guys requested that I do this video about liquid lipsticks that are not flaky, are comfortable and are uh, long lasting on your lips. Today's video I'm going to be talking just about liquid lipsticks that are comfortable, does not flake, last pretty long on your lips and are even comfortable to wear underneath mask as well. If you guys want to see a lipstick version of the same thing, let me know because these days I'm not compiling everything together because a lot of you guys are complaining that my videos are getting a little bit too long and I am realizing that as well so I'm going to try to make the videos a lot shorter so lipsticks would be a separate version so if you guys want to watch my favorite uh, bullet lipsticks video let me know so only if there are quite a lot of requests for that particular video I will do that for you guys so let's get started with my favorite lipsticks now I have something starting at I think 85 rupees or 100 rupees something really affordable so I will start off with the affordable option the first one I'm going to be talking about is the blue heaven special matte lip color now this one retails for just 65 rupees uh, this is in the shade number 09 these liquid lipsticks don't smell the best I have to let you guys know that but on the lips they are pretty pigmented not super pigmented they have sort of like that creamy moussey formula and they cover the pigmentation of my lips pretty well and they are comfortable and quite long lasting not super long lasting but pretty nice on the lips and it's not drying this is sort of a recent purchase for me but i still enjoy using this product and that's the reason i'm including it in this video so if you wanted something of a more affordable range you can try this one out and then the next one i'm going to be talking about is the maybelline uh, sensational liquid matte uh, lipstick this one is in the shade made easy i have two other shades in this particular range i love how affordable this is this one retails for 345 rupees but you can always get it on a sale for a much lesser price now this one i really like because it's one affordable the other one is the pigmentation of these they are equal to mask pigmentation of my lips they are pretty pigmented for the price and they are comfortable as well uh usually if they are very pigmented then they tend to dry your lips out this can be slightly drying if you have very dry lips so you have to apply a lip balm underneath this some things like the blue heaven one you don't really even need to apply a lip balm underneath it but uh, this one you do need a lip balm underneath it let it rest on your lips for at least 10 minutes before you apply the liquid lipstick and after that it's really nice it's pretty long wearing matte formula and it's not sticky i don't really like the maybelline super stay liquid lipsticks because i find them to be really sticky on the lips they just like stick together and i'm not able to use them as much because of that but this one is not like that it's so it's a lot more budget friendly lip friendly uh you can have Food with this if you have very oily meal most of these liquid lipsticks will fade away but but if you're just having like rice or uh, sipping something these do last a decent amount of time they might fade a little bit towards the center of the lips but uh, that's not happened to me so far so that's the reason i'm recommending these to you and then something else from the more affordable range from lacme i have the lacme forever matte liquid lip color these retail for 295 rupees and i think you can find them on discount i'm not very sure if i've seen this on discount ever but they are pretty affordable I have these in a couple of shades but the shade that I have with me right here is Nude Twist and Mauve Ecstasy. So these are not as pigmented as your typical liquid lipsticks or even the Maybelline ones. These two slightly lack pigmentation but not like very sheer and watery formula. This is sort of moussey so if you are familiar with Miss Claire Soft Matte Lip Cream, uh, the NYX Soft Matte Lip Cream, these are similar to that. And these are comfortable on the lips. They last for a decent amount of time. So if you are someone who doesn't really like very dry liquid lipsticks and those very pigmented uh, liquid lipsticks that suck the moisture out of your lips, but you're not a fan of normal bullet lipsticks to wear underneath masks because they keep transferring, then you can try these out. And even if you wanted to wear it to some occasion or uh, something that doesn't fade away easily from your lips, you can still try these out and they wouldn't uh, flake and dry your lips out. So that's the reason I'm recommending this and this is one of my favorite formulas as well and i'm just not talking about this just in terms of like performance i also am looking at budget i'm looking at the lasting power i'm looking at the pigmentation and everything so i have different points to cover when i'm talking about different products in this video so the next one i'm going to be talking about might not be a popular opinion maybe a lot of you guys don't really like this this is the l'oreal liquid lipstick now i have a bunch of shades these were sent to me last year but ever since i've started wearing masks i find a lot more usage out of these products because i'm not a lip tint person and i don't really own a lot of lip tints 
and I feel like um, I want something which is pretty long lasting but not as pigmented or drying on the lips. Something that performs like a lip tint and is long lasting. So that's the reason I uh, started using these products and one major pro of this product is they are pretty runny okay so they are not pigmented enough but they are not very drying as well and very long lasting and when they fade away they just don't fade away like that they leave a beautiful stain on the lips a stain that lasts for a long time so it looks like you have something on your lips it's not like everything is gone and you have no lip product left on your lips so on days where I just want a little bit of a color to my lips like a tint this is what I use and I feel like it does the job for me and it performs beautifully on the lips so I've had like pasta with this pizza with this and still performs well and it's always easy to reapply these as well just take a little bit and dab it on your lips I use it with my fingers sometimes use the wand and apply it so that's a really nice thing they do take a little bit of a time to dry down but once they do they leave a tint so if you want something very pigmented you wouldn't like that I'm telling you straight up and then the flower beauty miracle matte liquid lip color they have quite a few shade options for you guys to choose from but I have this one in the shade scarlet letter this is a orange toned red shade very pigmented quite long lasting and not as drying on the lips as well so a really nice liquid lip a formula this one retails for 965 rupees but you can always find these on discount and i was looking to buy more shades but i have so many lipsticks that if i keep buying the same thing from like the same brand i cannot try out the different uh, options available for me so that's the reason i just stuck to one shade and uh, it's sort of like a different formula it takes a little bit of a time to dry down if i am right because um, you know i have to when i'm speaking on camera you have to remember so many different points that you might miss out a few points here and there so when you first apply it it is a little bit thick a little bit sticky but it's not like sticky like the Maybelline uh, liquid lipstick it uh, settles in pretty well and then it's just comfortable on your lips pigmented and long lasting so that's what I remember from my usage with this liquid lipstick and then my favorite liquid lipstick formula the Chambord liquid lipsticks uh, I have this one in the shade 483 484 and 482 um, 484 is a lot less long lasting compared to 483 and 482 I don't know what the problem is 484 uh, kind of fades away when I'm talking as well and if I sip something it just fades away from the center but 482 and 483 are a lot more long lasting very comfortable very pigmented and amazing shade selection so and these days you can find these liquid lipsticks on discount as well which is an amazing thing i think this one retails for 865 rupees and you can find it for 15 percent off 30 percent off most of the time so that's the time to pick it up i am looking to buy the shade 406 because it's so tempting to buy those deep red shades and i'm always looking at those um so I really like this. Uh, these are your typical liquid lipsticks, okay? They are of a runny consistency. Once you apply it, they are pigmented, they dry down very fast and uh, they look really nice and last for a decent amount of time. But if you have very, very dry lips and you don't really like liquid lipsticks, um, I want to say you would still like this. I'm not sure how it works, but when I have dry lips, I can still pull this one off and it's not one bit uncomfortable. It feels lightweight on the lips, feels like I have nothing on the lips. So I think that if you are someone who uh, despises liquid lipsticks, you would still really like this one. And then something you now you can find it online in India, which is amazing, is the Sephora Cream Lip Stain. The shade range they have, I am looking to buy some of those and swatch it for you guys because I'm amazed with the shade range. The pigmentation is oh my god amazing and i'm super impressed with this these are comfortable on the lips they are even better than the next soft matte lip creams okay they are like a lip cream but they are way more pigmented way more long lasting and feels amazing on the lips so this is a dupe i don't really know the shade number i think this was in the shade uh, rosewood i'm not very sure i will leave it in the description box below but this was a shade dupe for mac uh, retro matte liquid lipstick in the shade carnivorous i have done that uh, I see a lot of people keep asking me for MAC topped with brandy dupes and everything. I've already swatched it, you guys. I will link it right here. And I don't really like the MAC Carnivorous Liquid Lipstick formula because they kind of uh, flake away, chip, fade away a lot faster. But this one is like bulletproof. So if you guys have been sleeping on the Sephora Cream Lip Stains, you should definitely, definitely check this out. And something you can't really find online, but you can find these in stores 
are these Kiko Milano liquid lipsticks. I'm not very sure why they're not selling this online, but in most Kiko Milano stores, you can find this. You can find this for like buy two, get two. Uh, at least when I bought it, it was buy two, get two. So I have two other shades, but the most used shades are these two. This one is in the shade number 06 and 07. The shade number 07 is the one that I use most of the time. Such a beautiful deep pink shade. Deep pink. What is that? Okay. Deep pink shade. I'm not someone who likes pink. Okay. But these days, because I found the right pink shades, I'm just so much into pink shades and I've started loving them. And this one is amazing on the lips. Very long lasting, you guys. Super long lasting. And even if you have like a very big meal, whatever you have, it's still going to last on your lips. Maybe you fade away a little bit here and there and bleed just a little bit. You can still fix that by wiping it with your fingers or tissue. And that's it. Super long lasting. If I wear this in the morning, I don't really even have to touch this up. And only by like evening, I even see a very strong stain and i have to take it off with my makeup remover that's how long lasting this is this is like smudge proof transfer proof food proof everything proof liquid lipstick and um, it feels lightweight on the lips not very drying but doesn't lack pigmentation which is amazing so if you guys see this i don't really hear a lot of people talk about it this is such an underrated product but pick this up after watching this video, you will not regret this, especially the shade number 07 and thank me later. Thank me later. So, you know, things that people don't usually notice, but suddenly they notice that happened to me with this shade. So my mom doesn't really know how long lasting a lipstick is or a liquid lipstick is because she's not a lipstick person. She's never worn lipstick, but she noticed that uh, this shade, this one particularly was lasting on my lips and she, her and my husband, both of them decided to com comment about it at the same time. They're like, your lipstick is still there. Because we had a very big meal. I took her out for her birthday lunch. We had a very big meal. And then it still stayed in place. And I was like, oh, really? Amazing. Amazing. When you wear a mask uh, and talk, okay, I've noticed this, that most lipsticks do kind of bleed a little bit here and there. But um, I just wipe it away. That, that does happen to me with this lipstick as well like when you wear a mask and it's like sticking and then it's moist and you're talking it will budge a little bit yeah but not too much not like the entire lipstick is on your mask and then uh, another thing from Kiko Milano this one is their uh, dual lipstick this has a lipstick on one side and a lip gloss or they also have another one where there's just the liquid lipstick very long lasting these take a while to dry at least a good two minutes to dry down completely but they do not move from your lips not drying very long lasting and you have to really use like an oil based makeup remover to take this off i will link the other one that you can find on nika so this is the shade number 121 but if you can even find the other one it's still really nice very long lasting and i feel like kiko milano is a very underrated brand and have amazing products so try this one out even the lip gloss is really nice but the lip liquid lipstick is and then uh, from Balm, the Meat Matte Hues in the shade number Adoring and Charming. These are the two shades that I have. Uh, very pigmented, okay? Not super pigmented like the Kiko Milano ones or anything, but they are pigmented. Way more than soft matte lip creams. I'm giving this as a reference for most of these liquid lipsticks because these are of a similar consistency. They are not very liquidy, but they're not very thick. They are like that moussey consistency. This one is so nice on the lips, feels lightweight, very, very long wearing and um, doesn't dry your lips out. So that's the reason I really like these liquid lipsticks. And uh, I every, every single time I see more sales on Balm, I, I'm tempted to buy some of their other shades. But because I have so many liquid lipsticks and lipsticks, like I mentioned, I have to try out different brands as well, different formulas. So I can't just resort to one product, but amazing. Whoever I've recommended this one to has loved it. And I'm sure if you would, if you're looking for a deep red shade, try out the shade Adoring and you wouldn't regret it at all, you guys. These are the lipsticks you should wear for weddings, special occasions and everything and you wouldn't regret it because it wouldn't flake, it wouldn't dry your lips out and feel like lightweight. And then the Too Faced Melted Matte Liquid Lipstick. Mm. 
प्राइस पॉइंट इन इंडिया इज प्रिटी गुड इट्स नॉट लाइक मैक वे इट्स अबव टू थाउजेंड स्मैश बॉक्स इज अबव टू थाउजेंड एवरीथिंग इज अबव टू थाउजेंड दिस वन इज फॉर जस्ट थाउजेंड सिक्स हंड्रेड रुपीज एंड आई रिसेंटली सॉ देर वॉज अ सेल ऑन टू फेस लिक्विडिप्स लाइक बाई टू गेट वन और समथिंग लाइक दैट सो दैट्स अमेजिंग बाई वन गेट वन और बाई टू एंड गेट वन एंड यू कूड ऑल्सो सिलेक्ट द शेड्स नॉट अ लॉर्ड ऑफ शेड्स बट थ्री ऑफ देयर शेड्स लाइक लेडी बॉल सेल आउट एंड बेंड एंड स्नैप दिस इज इन द शेड बेंड एंड स्नैप ब्यूटिफुल पिंक शेड again this was that liquid lipstick that made me fall in love with pink shades and it's not as deep as the kiko milano uh, liquid lipstick like the shade but it's pretty good and very pigmented long lasting smudge proof um matte liquid lipstick not very drying on the lips but very long lasting so if you are looking for something like that especially if you want to buy some shades for your wedding and if you wanted to wear a liquid lipstick for your wedding something that is dry your lips out but can also mask the pigmentation of your lips but long lasting as well try out something from uh, too faced and i'm sure i'm sure you're going to love it you're not going to be disappointed the wand is easy to apply i i know i haven't spoken about the wand of most of these but they all are the similar to doe foot applicators but i just don't really like it when the wand is too long because i don't get a precise application but other than that all of these have ease of application and this one is the same as well and then i'm not sure if you can find this in india but i'm just going to mention it in case you do i'm going to look up the sephora india website just to see if this is available but if you can get these they are amazing okay these are one of the oldest liquid lipsticks i own they've not gone rancid one bit stays on the lips very pigmented super long lasting they do bleed a little bit like if you have a very cheesy pasta or something but again manageable you can fix it it's not going to be a disaster on your lips and this shade and aria particularly very different and i love this formula itself you guys super long lasting pigmented on the lips something that is available easily in india is a huda beauty liquid matte lipstick this is in the shade trophy wife i have the shade vixen i have the shade famous icon i have a couple of shades the reason i bought so many shades is because of the formula of this um they are a little bit watery when you apply it and again take a little time to dry down but once they do they are a beautiful matte finish they're not very heavy feeling on your lips they don't really feel like the sugar liquid lipsticks where they feel heavy on your lips these are not like that they don't suck out the moisture from your lips and uh, they are pretty decently long lasting they're not very long lasting they do bleed a little bit very easily compared to a lot of these but i really like the formula how it feels on the lips and the color selection they have generally put together everything it's a really nice liquid lipstick formula i really like that and that's the reason i've included it in this video and then again something you can't find easily in india but you can find it on instagram stores and also and if dose of colors do launch in india you can get your hands on this this is the dose of colors liquid lipstick i have this one in the shade chocolate wasted not very runny a little bit moussey but pigmented on your lips very comfortable and super long lasting and their shade selection is really nice they smell really good as well so something that i have really been enjoying using the shade is not my favorite it's a little bit of a darker deep brown shade but the formula in general is really nice and i like to lighten this up with other shades so yeah that's pretty much it these were all the liquid lipsticks that i really like and you can try out most of the shades like i just have a couple of shades that i mentioned but you can try out these ranges in general like i'm just talking about the range of liquid lipsticks that you can try out let me know what are your favorite liquid lipstick formula something that you are an ardent lover of i know a lot of you guys like the wet and wild liquid lipstick i love it too but they dry down on the tube and that's the reason i didn't mention those here but yeah let me know your favorite liquid lipstick formula ever and i would love to try those out oh yeah and something else i forgot to mention are the uh, uh, is the disguise cosmetics liquid lipstick in the shade relaxed mocha a really nice um terracotta red shade but the formula in general is really nice they're not very very pigmented they are a little bit runny on the lips and um they do settle to a matte finish but not very pigmented but very comfortable for like day to day usage that's pretty much it i hope you guys enjoyed this video and found it helpful give this video a big thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so that you're notified every time i upload a new video and i'll see you guys in my next one bye